Online shopping is expected to increase this year. With that, so are scams. The Better Business Bureau estimates people will buy more than half of their gifts online this holiday shopping season. And it, the BBB wants you to be aware of cyber criminals. Our ABC 17's Morgan Burrish spoke with the BBB about what you should look out for to avoid becoming a victim to an online scam. The National Retail Federation expects online shopping to increase between 7 to 9 percent this year, up to more than $270 billion. Better Business Bureau Regional Director Kisha Duncan says it's important to do your research before making any purchases. You can be anxious because you're excited, oh, I found that item. Just don't click on anything, don't make a purchase, don't give out your credit card number or input anything until you're comfortable. She says ways to check you're dealing with a verified retailer include making sure the website URL begins with HTTPS, checking if the business is verified with the BBB, and checking customer reviews. Integral technology expert Burton Kelso says people should be wary of bogus sites for small or unknown companies. Most of these companies are just a Google search away. So rather than just concentrate on the deal, you need to concentrate on not getting tricked by a variety of scams that are on the internet. Common scams that occur during the holidays are phishing scams, such as notifications that a package can't be delivered. In fact, I got this text earlier this month that says a package can't be delivered. Now, if you get these notifications and you aren't sure if it's legitimate or not, Duncan says you can go to the retailer that you purchased something from and use their direct tracking link. If you see misspellings in the email, um, grammatical errors, things just don't look quite right, use your instinct and your intuition and don't click on anything. Just delete that email. Morgan Burrish, ABC 17 News. And thanks to Morgan for that report tonight. If you're scammed, you should contact local authorities, notify your credit card company, and report that scam to the BBB or FTC.